Hey everyone, we are out at the 5th Annual United Way Trap Tournament and we want to say thanks to our sponsors for making this night such a great success. So you'll see beside me here our premier sponsors are Douglas Machine as well as Geneva Capital. So thanks so much for your support of the United Way Trap Tournament. We also have two additional sponsors we'd like to recognize and so we've got our Target sponsor here with Bell Bank and our Rain sponsor right next to me, American Solutions for Business. We also couldn't have this tournament without our in-kind donations. So we'd like to thank HPS Rental for their restroom facilities and hand washing station. Henry's Foods for some beef jerky and water. 3M for the ear protection and also Alex Shooting Park for allowing us to be out here today. We're going to announce our prize drawing winners. Um, just so you know, we will contact you via email. If you don't hear from us um, and you find someone who's a winner, reach out to your team captain because I do have their emails. So I'm going to start with the really awesome camouflage camp chair. And that one goes to Josh Schoenrock. Okay, we're going to go to the Mojo Rippler Duck Commander decoy here. And that one goes to David Jelland. David Jelland. The silent spin seat bucket is Tony Rudder or Cutter. Sorry, I cut the name off there. Okay, now we're gonna go to the Green Igloo Cooler, and the winner of the Green Igloo Cooler is Michael Hawk. 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 The backpack, Bruce Harvey. All right, next up we're doing binoculars. Let's see. Binoculars go to Adnan Hawk is the winner of the binoculars. Congratulations. The lunch cooler set here, Scott Green. Okay, now this is my favorite. This is a Cordzilla bungee cord, and this one is going to Brian Quiddick. Brian Quiddick, you're the winner. The shell pouch is going to Ashton Toft. Atomic beam flashlight. The next winner is Jacob Thorstad. And the last thing, the easy thrower and the box of targets is going to Tom Headstrom. Congratulations, Thank everybody. Thanks for joining us. We just wrapped up our fifth annual United Way Track Tournament. Lots of participants, a gorgeous evening, and we're about to announce all of our winners. So we're gonna start with the team awards and then we'll move into individual awards and our high gun award is how we'll wrap it up. So let's start with our third place team. Congratulations to the Brandon Evansville team of students sponsored by Geneva Capital. Team members on that team were Riley Bitson, Braden England, Chase Holtberg, Hunter Graffin, and Spencer Olson. Congratulations, Brandon Evansville, and thanks to Geneva Capital for sponsoring them. The second place winning team was Agar team number one. Team members are Jake Thorstad, Jamie Javis, James Olson, Austin Griesert, and Luke Creville. Now moving into our first place team, this year's trap tournament was won by Alec Power Equipment with team members Tom Townsend, Blaine Gulbrunson, Mark Nori, Scott Green, and Luke Kalina. Congratulations to everyone who participated. We had a great day. Thanks for being out here with us. Next up, we're going to announce our high gun winners for each skill level category. So starting with our novice category, we have Jake Chase Holtberg from Brandon Evansville with a score of 45. Um, for our intermediate high gun, we have Jared Smith from Agar, who shot with their third team, um, and with another score of 45, popular score today. And something really exciting happened with our experienced shooters. Um, we had a tie for first place with a score of 50, so a perfect um, score of 50. And in order to do a tiebreaker, since the teams had all left, um, we looked at their practice scores, which they had shot on the range, and Spencer Olson had a practice score of eight, so he is getting our experienced individual high winner. And from Alec Power Equipment, Scott Green got a first place because he scored a perfect 10 on his practice round. So he's going to get our high gun plaque. Thanks again for coming out. We had a great time at the Trap Park and we hope to see you next year.